Hollow by Artifacts of Mars. And this is one of the quirkiest stories I've seen in some time. With an obvious liberal who thinks that she has some kind of guilt trip laid on her or something. Lorella Willis put the sign on herself. Black America, I'm sorry, you can see it right here. She walked around the south side of Chicago, apologizing to black America. I watched the video, and people were actually, you know, they give her a wink and a nod, or wave to her or something. I have to admire her for her bravery, at least. I mean, she's walking around where angels fear to tread, which is the south side of Chicago. WVON radio talk show host Mark Wallace spotted Willis walking on 87th Street. I won't put her up to this if she woke up and decided, White America, there's a problem. We need to do something about it. Uh, okay. If you, gotta, if you really want to apologize to Black America, there are some things that can be done. How many of you liberals voted for Lyndon B. Johnson? He was the biggest exploiter of blacks you could imagine. It was Lyndon B. Johnson who sat, started the so-called Great Society, and you see how it's turned out. It was Lyndon B. Johnson who said, I'll have, and this is a quote, I will have these niggers voting Democratic for the next hundred years. That is a direct quote from Lyndon B. Johnson. Lyndon Baines Johnson, the president. Of course, you don't hear that from mainstream media. I personally find this rather insulting towards blacks because, you know, does she think that whites are responsible for blacks? No. Uh, we eliminate slavery, blacks are responsible for themselves, and they're responsible for this country, too. They have just as much responsibility for this country as I do, as a, someone of Chinese descent does. But the only ones you might make a case for is the American Indians who got screwed. But even they have it far better than their ancestors did. Their ancestors were starving half the time. I mean, real hunger. Yeah, the American Indians got screwed. So you might make a case for them. But, uh, as far as black Americans, I, if I was a black person, I would feel insulted, to be honest with you. So, no. We need to take responsibility for our own uh, neighborhoods, drive out the gang members. We, uh, I, I'm going to put myself in the place of a black person and I'm going to say a few things. It's going to piss some people off, but that's okay. I... Okay, this is Artifacts Mars. I can't talk like a black person, but here you go. Personally, I find this insulting. We are responsible for our own neighborhoods, and we've done a poor job in many respects. We've allowed our children to listen to garbage which is made by nasty, crotch-grabbing perverts who have an English vocabulary just not even the size of that of Coco the Gorilla. We've allowed the gang members to infest our neighborhoods instead of driving them out. We've allowed the federal government to poison our communities by getting us hooked on welfare instead of building the businesses and 
coming together to create wealth in order to feed our people. No, madam, this is an insult to us, and I wish you would put away your signs. That's the kind of thing I want to hear from black folk on this. What does this woman think? Is she, uh, does she think of herself as a slave owner or something? I mean, if you're black, pe black people in America are responsible for their own actions. As are people of Chinese descent, white, brown, whatever. You're responsible for your own actions and your own neighborhoods. This is my point. Whitey does not have responsibility for you. I'm very sorry. You wanted to eliminate slavery? We did that a long time ago, at least supposedly. That's a little more of a complicated story, but uh, with that comes responsibility. You want to be on your own, you have to be responsible for yourself. You have to take care of yourself. It all goes hand in hand, folks. And you allow uh, kids to listen to nasty, uh, misogynist noise from these so-called rappers. You allow them to listen to that. You know, you should be ashamed of yourselves. I, you shouldn't not even allow that in your house. I mean, generally, like you said, they're uh, crotch-grabbing perverts who can't even speak as much English as Coco the Gorilla. Sorry, I don't have any responsibility for uh, blacks in America. They have responsibility for themselves. Just like I do. Just like people of Chinese descent Japanese descent, Mexican descent, whatever. You're responsible for yourself. Sorry. I have zero sympathy for this. Brave woman, to be sure. But not terribly bright. I'm Artifacts of Mars. Thanks for watching.